All right. All right. Hey, everybody. What's up? Yep, this is me. This is Weapon 13 White Fang. Probably don't sound at all like what you all thought, but sadly, this is me. So, you know, deal with it in therapy or whatever you will. Okay, so, on Dev, I had you all give me a bunch of questions to answer right. And some of you came up with some very interesting ones, I will admit that. I'm like, okay. But, um, yeah. I will just give you these simple questions first, the ones that, you know, most people want to know and blah, 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 blah. Alright, what's my name? Well, as I said, it's Weapon 13 White Fang, but... If you must know my real name, it's Lindsay. But uh, most people call me Liz. Uh, some call me Lizzie just because, like, you know, I'm very small looking, so they think little kids. So it's like, eh, Lizzie. I don't know. Don't ask me. Um, let's see. How old am I? Hmm. Well, I'm 20. I know I may not sound it, but I am. I'm 20, and I will be turning 21 on October 18th, and I'm probably going to get very, um, Happy juice. Let's let's go with that. Uh, <laughs> hmm. All right. Uh, where are you from, and are you living there right now? Well, I'm from Missouri. You know that little state that's like right in the middle of the map that looks like a really weird. Uh, I don't know what did my teacher call it. He called it like a. Looks like one of those things that somebody grabbed and they just squished the hell out of it, like a stress ball that got squished. I don't know. I don't know how he got that, but I always think of squish ball when I think of where I'm from. Um, and am I still here now? Yeah, I'm still here in Missouri. I know a lot of y'all probably think I'm from Texas, but I'm not, I swear. Um, that's just my character, and I'll get onto that later, but, um, let's see. Random question, what's the time? It is 8.06 p.m. here. Yeah, uh, I'm doing this kind of late, because I have college to deal with right now, so it's like, uh... <laughs> Now, next question is, is it cold where you are? Right now, well, we're kind of having some bipolar weather. See, if you live in Missouri or ever come to visit, you all need to realize that we have no real weather set. Like, one day it could be snowing at the biggest snowstorm in history, only for it to be, like, 50 or 70 the next day, and with clear skies and birds chirping and puppies playing in, you know, the yard. It's just really weird. Um, let's see, what am I wearing right now? Well, you can't see, but I'm wearing a black tank top and Gumby, yes, Gumby, boy shorts, and my glasses, that's it. Oh, and, you know, undergarments, but, you know, that's very common. Okay, um, what was the last thing you listened to? Actually, I'll let you all listen to that right now. song, right? I love that song. It's just very paranoidy. Okay, what was the last thing I ate? Chinese food. I had shrimp fried rice and crab rangoo with uh, sweet and sour sauce on top because I haven't had Chinese food in forever and me are college student and I'm tired of eating the school's cafeteria food. Okay, what was the last thing I watched on TV? Uh, that was actually uh, Law and Order. Criminal Intent, because I am really big into those kind of shows, like, you know, NCIS, Criminal Minds, stuff like that. What's my favorite TV show and why? Hmm. I guess right now my favorite TV show, if you're talking about, like, cartoon-wise, it's Adventure Time, because it's, like, happiness on uber crack for, like, kids and teens, and even adults watch it. Or, I guess it would also be tied with, yes, y'all are going to laugh at this and I don't care, My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic. I am a brony. Woo! Applejack for the world for me. Okay, I kind of like Rainbow Dash, but I think people are too, like, woo! for her anyway. But anyway, Applejack for me. And I guess if you're talking live action, it would be The Big Bang Theory. Because who doesn't love Sheldon and who doesn't love Penny, who's like, the definition of a stereotype blonde, but has some common sense. And it makes me laugh because I'm a blonde. Uh, 
And the reason why these are my favorite shows is because they're, like, really all I watch right now because I'm not really big into TV these days because I don't really have time for it. And, uh, yeah. Another question, what was the last movie you saw and how was it? Okay, in theaters, the last movie I saw was either Happy Feet 2 or Alvin and the Chipmunks, the Chipwrecked one or whatever. And the Chipwrecked one I went and saw with my little cousin because I promised him I'd take him to go see a movie he really wanted to see, and he really wanted to see this. And uh, so I sat through it, and the only good part about it was that I like Alvin and the Chipmunk music, you know. So that made me happy. Otherwise, I was like, this storyline is so predictable. Ugh. Bleh. Anyway, and for Happy Feet 2, I went and saw that on my own because, yes, I like penguins. Don't judge me. Okay, uh, here's a fun question. Do you have an accent? Well, I don't know. I'm, I, I'm told I do, but it's not that strong. It's like a tame version of a southern accent, but it's, you know, I say y'all and, you know, that right there and all that stuff, but, you know, it's nothing unusual around here. Some people just talk really proper. Some are just like, you know, ding -da -ling, -da -ling, -da -ling, -da ling I mean, I don't know how else to describe it. Um, you know, compared to a British accent, I'm, I'm pretty tame or like a heavy southerner. Because like, if you listen to them, you're like, woo! <laughs> Boy, you need to slow down. So, uh, no, I don't really think I have that much of an accent. I think I just talk how I am. Okay, so here are the questions that y'all sent me. Um, I'm going to start out with the simple ones first because those are the ones that, you know, I can just get out of the way. And then some of you ask me uh, questions about movies. And, like, I'll have to push those aside for, like, at the end because, like, I'm really opinionated on movies considering that's what my uh, education is going to be towards is, like, directing and acting in films. So... You know, I'm very, pretty deeply opinionated on it. But uh, here, uh, I'll just answer some fun ones for now. Okay. My friend Diane sent me this one, and I just had to do this one first because it's so funny. And, you know, I know you're being a smartass, Diane. Thanks. Um, the question is, what is the meaning of life? Hmm. Uh, well, in my personal opinion, life is just life. And we were created to try to find our own happiness. We were meant to look for what makes us happy, whether it be, you know, marriage or kids or, you know, a career or whatever, you know. I mean, it's whatever makes you happy. And if you can find that happiness, that is what your life is going to be. That's what you are meant to do. That's your life. Now, I'm not saying, you know, just because, you know, you found the w one true thing you want to do and suddenly, you know, you're supposed to die. No, that's not at all what I'm saying. Don't, don't, don't go dying, please, if you can help it. Um, yeah. Uh, no, I'm saying that, uh, once you find that, you know, you, you found your center, you found you. You found the one thing that many people struggle for. And that's something you ought to be proud of. All right, next question. Best? Jackie Earl Haley movie, but this is from Screaming Lord Rocky, and, hmm, good question. Okay, for those of you that don't know who Jackie Earl Haley is, and if you don't, what is wrong with you? Okay, Jackie Earl Haley was a child star actor, in, you know, back in the early 70s. He did some stuff, you know, when he was a real little kid, too, but he's mostly known for his 70s and up stuff, and... He was Kelly Leak on the original Bad News Bears, not this remake one with Billy Bob Thornton, who gives me the creeps. No, uh, he played the punk kid that drove around on the Harley Davidson and wore the black shirt and the shades and, you know, was just a regular little badass who could play baseball. And later on, uh, Jackie was known for getting some really weird roles. I mean, like, if just go watch Zoo Gang and... Well, I don't know if you should watch Zoo Gang. It's just one of those films that, you know, I'm sure every time he watches it, he's like, what the fuck was I thinking? But, you know, it, it happens. <laughs> you know, we all we all take what we can get sometimes, and that's what he did.